your average commute is pretty rubbish unless you get to drive one of these in the city of hyderabad india you'll find the ultimate motorhead but he's not just a collector sudhakar makes the world's craziest cars from everyday objects like a computer, tennis ball or burger to a toilet and a christmas tree he's made just about anything you can think of this is the only handmade wacky car museum in the world uh, well i've created about uh, 700 uh, different type of uh, vehicles uh, at the age of 14 i started growing up near local junkyards sudhakar was always finding something to build but it wasn't always cars his love of wheels started with bicycles and after that i worked on lot of motorcycles uh, vintage cars vintage double decker buses for the tourism the first wacky car i made is a shoe shape car and then i made a camera car but sudhakar did not stop there he went on to make hundreds of wacky designs cricket bat shape car cricket ball shape car football basketball golf ball christmas tree shape car mug shape car he's even made a drivable snooker table as a child i used to tell him to make something that i'd see around probably like a sharpener car or a pencil bike or you know eraser those are the things that would interest a child uh, i i'm taking the legacy forward with the museum not only the designing part i also assist him uh, with the management we sit together design it we flesh it out and give it a good structure i help him with the technical aspect of it as well now lots of people call him mad um, he believed in it he believed himself and uh, look where the museum is right now he is in touch with his inner child and he does whatever makes him truly happy even sudhakar's office is on brand it might come as a surprise but from 9 to 5 sudhakar runs his family's printing business making wacky cars is not his full time job my hobby is not expensive my hobby is quite time consuming uh, at least uh, 4 to 5 hours every day i'm still working we see that how big it should be for the wheel placement then i go to the junkyards and uh, how much power we need every car is a challenging job each wacky car his team creates is totally unique and they're always designed from scratch so to build one car can take anywhere from 3 months to a whole year it's no surprise he has earned his place in record books with his most impressive achievement being the world's largest tricycle and it's not just sudhakar with the big ideas it struck me that we don't have anything specially designed for women and i said you know we have to have an entire series uh, an indian traditional bridal car a handbag and a stiletto all of these have been uh, designed by me so i bring a little bit of femininity into the entire museum when i started the museum with a small shed i kept on adding the cars because i don't like to sell them since then, Sudhakar has built a pretty big extension on his shed and his collection has caught the attention of all the locals, especially on the roads. I used to have road shows organized by the government of uh, Andhra Pradesh, you know, and then we give free rides to the children, you know, they love it. If you can't get to Hyderabad, it might not be long before there's a museum on your doorstep. So we have uh, a museum coming up in Lonavla, which is close to Bombay. Before moving westward, we want to tap into Far East. Countries like Singapore, Malaysia, and uh, we want to expand it to the rest of the world. If they can't come down to India, we'll bring it to them. In the beginning, people used to call me mad. A circus guy. I love doing it, I enjoy doing it. And, uh, that is more important. So that excitement is still there.